Unfortunately, Android phones don't usually last longer than like 24 hours or so on a full charge. But fortunately for us, Android has built in adaptive battery. And those software engineers there recognize that a lot of things are draining your battery in the background. So what is adaptive battery and what are some of the ways you can take advantage of it? In this video, I'm gonna show you what it is and then I'm gonna show you how to modify and look at some things in your settings that will hopefully extend the battery life of your phone so you don't just end up with a dead phone in the middle of nowhere. So adaptive battery essentially limits what's going on in the background of your apps. If you wanna see exactly what's happening and which programs, processors, etc., are using the most batteries in your phone, it's easy to do in an Android phone. This is a Pixel device, but it's similar in Samsung, other Android operated devices. So first you go into your settings on your phone and then you click on battery. Pretty obvious, go to battery. At the top, you'll see one that says battery usage. So if you click on battery usage, you can see that <clears throat> which apps are using the most battery on your phone. And then if you click on this option down here, you can also see by systems, which systems are using the most battery on your phone. So you can see that the CPU is actually using the most, 34% of the battery usage is coming from the central processing unit on your phone. So there are some certain Android phones where you can turn down the CPU usage, like on Samsung Galaxy phones, for example, and that will actually save you a lot of battery. Then the screen, so if you wanna save some battery on your screen, you can dim it a little bit. The mobile network, so you might, your phone's probably searching for wireless or a 5G connection. Um, I've showed you in other videos how to switch to 4G. For example, if there's not a 5G network close to you, you're gonna be using up battery just searching for the 5G. You can see the camera, Bluetooth, voice calls, Wi-Fi. These are all things that are using up the battery on your phone, including ambient display. So this just shows you what the battery usage is. Adaptive battery is essentially Android system where it tries to limit the usage of those things in the background to optimize the lifespan of your battery. If you want to turn on adaptive battery usage or adaptive charging on your phone, you click on adaptive charging. And on certain devices, this is a Pixel 7a, it just shows adaptive charging. You can turn it on or off. On other devices, you can see um, adaptive battery as another toggle button, which I'll show you also right here. So adaptive charging, essentially it tries to understand when you plug in your phone, create a rhythm and know that, oh, usually plug in your phone at 11 o'clock at night because that's when you go to bed, for example. And so around 10 o'clock, maybe an hour before, if you have enough battery, your phone's not gonna really make that big of an effort to stop using the CPU, apps in the background, etc., because it's gonna charge in like an hour. So adaptive battery, if that's on, adaptive charging, it's kind of like the Nest thermostat does where it tries to understand your usage, behavior patterns, etc. And with AI, more and more devices and things are trying to understand your behavior like that. Beyond just using the battery usage option within your battery uh, location on your settings, you can also go into the bottom where it says battery diagnostics. Click on that and you can see some questions. Oh, my fo phone is warm, um, checking temperature. You can actually see the temperature of your phone right there. I didn't realize that until I started playing around with it earlier today. So I'm at 72 degrees Fahrenheit, which is in the green or normal range on there. Um, you can also see if the battery is draining too quickly. An option is to change to dark theme, which will drain the battery less quickly, apparently. So if you change to dark theme, you can turn that on. And then the apps that are using more battery, I showed you earlier, this is a similar path to the same area in the battery usage. So you can see the apps in here that are using the most battery. I hope this video was helpful for you. I hope you can extend the life of your phone, um, plug it in when you get a chance, and use adaptive battery. It's a useful feature that Android has built in. If you like the video, give it a like and subscribe to our channel. We'll see you again soon.